Pearls. Today, we are focusing on management decision making and the risks that come with them. Some decisions can be high risk, but if they are successful, they will bring high rewards. Businesses often try to reduce risk with a scientific decision making approach. Managers will expect to bring rewards which can be financial, such as higher sales or profit, or beneficial in other ways like higher productivity or lower staff turnover. Your homework for today, guys, is to find an example of a company which has used this scientific decision making approach and explain the benefits and drawbacks of their decision. Good morning, everyone. Today, we're looking at strategies and why strategies fail. Now, the most crucial point of strategic drift is phase four. In this phase, the business must decide to make a transformational change or it will potentially cease to exist. The business can do this by changing leadership or drastically changing its current strategy in an attempt to cope with the ever-changing market. Now, for the first... Boys, I'm like maths and chemistry. Oh, really? Oh, I thought it was good. Well, we can't get it. 